Hi folks, in today's video tutorial I'm going to show you how to compare two 3D models and I will use the standard functionality of copy and paste and then we will use some advanced feature. So let's start. First of all, over here you can see that we can compare any 3D model, it doesn't matter if it's gearbox or shaft or holder. So we have a 3D models, different sources maybe, different logic of the creation and you would like to see the differences and what does it mean you need to align these components so I have prepared these two components and you can see here that I can simply specify the, uh, the definition for the placement and for example we will align two surfaces and then again I will align the additional surfaces so we can simply and easy align what we want. So I have reused the separate windows for alignment. And if I will confirm, we can see that right now all components are aligned. Perfect. And so right now, for example, I'd like to select the references from the final object, yeah, the smaller one, and we would like to copy geometry in the original one. So I will select this component I will activate and I will hide this object because I don't want to see it and we will select simply the surface any surface from the model and if you use the right mouse button you are able to select body surfaces so I will select the body surfaces from the smaller component from the final doesn't matter you need to try it the copy from one side to another one and back or you can simply to see which component is smaller so i will select right now the all surfaces are selected and i will use the ctrl c and ctrl v and confirm what does it mean if i will right now activate the assembly ctrl a and if i will select and open the 3d model you can see that this component at the end include the copy geometry and right now we will use simply solidify feature and remove material and confirm OK when you confirm OK you can see that right now the system create cut based on the previous geometry of the copy geometry and right now you can see the differences of two components so this is the value what has been removed from previous component. If I will delete and I will jump back into assembly, I don't want to update the mass right now and we will unhide the components. Maybe we would like to make the additional feature or different, different logic how to compare this component. And I have found that it's possible to use the cutout. And if you would like to use the cutout, you can use the component and component operation. If What does it mean? You are able to use the boolean operation and I don't want to merge two components but I'd like to cut. And what is necessary to select? You will select the first component when the cutout will be created and then modifying components which component will make the cut into previous one. And if you confirm OK and if you confirm and open the original one you can see that system create a cutout based on the shape of the previous component so over here you have seen two possible ways how to compare differences on the models i hope so that you like this video tutorial push the like button and donate me by coffee thank you and bye bye vladimir